everyone today we are going to learn how you can find the dot product of a vector with itself now what does it mean it means you have only one vector and you have to find its dot product with itself so first of all we will write the formula for the dot product of a vector that we have uh, we generally have while finding the dot product of two vectors that is a dot b a is one vector b is another vector is equals to a magnitude of a magnitude of the vector a magnitude of the vector b cos theta so this is the formula for finding the dot product of vector geometrically so here we have two different vectors but if we say we have only one vector let's say one vector like this this is a vector and we call it a and we have to find its dot product with itself so another vector will also be a so we have these two vectors so how we can how we will write their dot product we will write their dot product geometrically as a vector a dot vector a now we don't have another vector so that so now we don't have another vector so that we may call it b as we have the a, uh, one vector and we are repeating it so a dot a is equals to the magnitude of a the magnitude of a cos theta now one thing here is very important if we are taking the only one vector and we are duplicating it it means both of these vectors are in the same direction so it will be obvious that the angle between them will be zero degree so if i write here so it will not be wrong to say that the dot product of a vector with itself refers that the two vectors will be parallel so two vectors are parallel and the angle between them will be zero degree so i must write here that theta is equals to zero degree so if i put the value of theta as zero degree in, in the above formula what i will get here will be dot product of the vector with itself will be equals to the magnitude of a magnitude of a and cos of zero cos of zero is equals to one so we will get magnitude of a square so this will be the formula for finding the dot product of a vector with itself this will this is the geometrical formula so how we will see it algebraically is let's see so algebraically you may find it as as we have seen in our previous lecture that you can find the dot product in two ways one is the geometrical way where you have the angle and the other is the algebraic way when you don't have the angle so how we can find it algebraically is a dot a is equals to a x plus a y it means the x component of a and the y component of a and if we multiply it with x component of a and y component of a so what we will get is the square of the x component plus the square of the y component so this is the this is how you can define it algebraically so these are the two methods of defining the dot product of a vector with itself now let's have an example so that you can have the clear concept whenever you are given with just one vector and you will be asked to find the dot product of that vector with itself let the vector be u is a vector and it is defined as 2 and 2 now what does it mean firstly you have x component and then the y component so you can easily say that this is the x component and this is the y component if you are given with a vector like this and you will have to find the dot product of this vector with itself so first of all we will find it geometrically then algebraically so you will see that you will get the same result so here we will find it algebraically and here we will find it geometrically so keep this in mind when you are going to find the dot product of a vector with itself theta is not the problem uh, we will have the information already that when you are taking the dot product of a vector with itself you will always have the angle theta is equals to 0 degree because both of these vectors will be parallel to each other so algebraically we can find it as u dot u is equals to x component of u plus y component of u into x component of u plus y component of u so but we have the x component of u is 2 as it is given above the y component of u is also also 2 so here we will write 2 plus 2 so what we will get is the multiplication will be like this and like this so what we will get is it will be equals to 4 plus 4 equals to 8 so this is the dot product of a vec given vector with itself now let's see how we can find the dot product of a vector geometrically so geometrically we have to use the uh, the method as we have to use the method as u dot u is equals to the magnitude of u dot the magnitude of u cos of theta as theta is equals to 0 because of the parallel vector so we will have the magnitude of u square so what we will get is so what we have to found is the magnitude of a vector so magnitude of the vector can be found as under root of the so under root square of the x component that is 2 square plus 
square of the y component then what we will get is under root 4 plus 4 is equals to under root 8. So, we will put this value in uh, 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 so we will put this value here what we will get is u dot u is equals to under root 8 square is equals to 8. So, we have got the same answer as in, in the algebraic method. So, this is how you can find the dot product of a vector with itself. Thank you.